So uh, Blair, three games out, you must be buzzing to get back though. Yeah, I'm looking forward to it massively. It's felt like it's been a lifetime, but um, no, I'm happy to be back now and hopefully I can help the boys hope we can get three points. How frustrating has it been these last three games not being able to be out there and uh, helping the boys? Yeah, it's been a nightmare to be fair. It's been really hard. Um, it's my first ever red card, um, so it's not, it's not been nice. Obviously, it's not been good because you have to watch the boys and although I want, want them to win, I'd love to be out there with them as well. So it's been difficult, but I've just had to make sure that I just keep myself in the best possible shape, that when I come back, I can give the boys the best opportunity and the best player that I can be, really. So that's all I really had to do in the meantime. So you say you kept yourself in shape. Obviously, you've been training all the time. You've been suspended. How's that been uh, with the new regime? Yeah, of course, it's been different. Um, it's been very intense. But I feel um, even when I'm playing, if I know I'm playing on a Saturday anyway, without the suspension, I have to be playing at training at full tilt as well. So it's been good for me. I think it's been good because I've not been playing, so I've had to work even harder on the training pitch. A few extras after training, a bit of running and that. But um, no, it's all for a good cause. And um, of course, nothing really beats match fitness, but you can only try to implicate and do the same thing when you're out on the training pitch. So it's helped, definitely. And uh, during your time off, you've uh, had a little go at uh, being a radio commentator as well. How was that? Yeah, it was all right. You know, I actually enjoyed it, to be fair. Um, I think I found a little, uh, a little role. I said to the boys, to be fair, I don't really want to be seeing them again. But um, if, they, if it ever does come about, then I could maybe do it. Um, but no, it was good. It's good to look at it from a different view of the pitch as well and see what they see. Um, so that was also something to be positive. But now it's all about showing while, I'm, while I've been away what I can bring to the team and what I can help the boys now. So moving on to Saturday's game, uh, what sort of game are you expecting? Um, well, we know it's going to be difficult. Um, of course, it's, it's too early to really look at the proceedings and the, 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 the actual league itself. But I think, um, as you can see, when I, when I falls, we know that we've not been good enough kind of thing. And um, they're almost near the same amount of points as us. So we know that it's going to be a big game. Um, but I think for us, it's about almost just doing what we're doing on a training pitch and getting back to basics. And hopefully um, we can get a win. And I think... There's a little bit of weight of expectation on you, really, from the supporters and I suppose everyone around the club in terms of you being what uh, Tristan described as a game changer. Do you think you thrive on that pressure? Yeah, definitely. I think in any, in any terms of life, any terms of football, you're going to get that sort of pressure and that's the type of player. You, if you're going to be a big player, you've got to thrive off that uh, pressure and you've got to make sure that it's justified in what everyone else is talking. And I think actions speak the loudest and that's what I've got to do on the pitch now. I've got to help the boys, um, not just by scoring, but just showing what I can do and help the boys to get a result and get some uh, chances and not just score, but also set up some goals also. So hopefully we can do that and hopefully we can get the three points. Yeah, that's the most important thing at the moment. And lastly, you seem to have developed a really good relationship with the fans, so you must be looking forward to uh, showing them what you're made of now for the rest of the season. Yeah, 100%. I think um, I can only apologise for getting red carded and I can only really make it up by when I go on the pitch giving 100% for the football club and hopefully we get some uh, good results and hopefully the run can start going in a positive manner now.